now all we've got to do is solder these little puppies in place not the easiest of jobs so I'll not be talking to you while I'm doing this and I need a bit of concentration tweezers very good idea stops your fingers getting burned and holds things really accurately well sorry about this guys that cheap poxy camera suddenly decided to stop capturing in 640 so I've had to drop the 320 still I'll give you an idea one day I'll make a professional video for YouTube now the first two pins we need to solder or well, I'm gonna solder I'll 10 and 16 and um, as I say you need to make sure that the little white bar goes to pin 16 uh, 13, 10 I'll just take my eyes out I can see better let's just tack that there we are gently tack that In there, you gotta be very quick because these diodes cook. And then gently tack that. Not to mention the fact the insulation melts. There we go. First one in. Eleven seventeen. There's pin 11. That's all you need. Insulation. Seventeen. Making sure you don't short the pins together. I'll do the other two because we're short on time and I'll show you the completed one, the completed plug. Okay guys, that is the diode bridge built. That one's a little high on that end but okay, nice neat soldering. Now what you need to do finally on this is you're going to need to put the cable which is over here you're going to need to put four of those wires five of those wires onto this plug now they go on to oh shit, Ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen, which are these pins here, and the ground, which is that big strip. And this is tricky because you don't want to desolder what you've already soldered. All right, this is the tricky bit, guys. I've altered the camera so you can see what I'm doing here and what I'm soldering. We need to solder our chosen coloured cables onto these four pins here 13, 12, 11 and 10 making sure we don't unsolder the diodes that are already there make sure you've tinned the end of the wires and the end of your iron and we just simply touch that's yellow. That's red. Oops. Let's try not to solder the camera. That's white. And black is being a pain. Set, solder the end of my finger. Yellow, red, white, black. And 
over this side of the plug. Not much cable left. This is the problem when using reclaimed cable. There we are. That's it. And that's our earth connected. And that's the finished end of the PC. With diode bridges in place. And in case you're wondering, yes it does fit inside the plug very nicely. Thank you very much. Now this end's always a little tricky because these plugs, just move the camera there, yeah. these plugs are a pain to solder as you saw me prepare earlier. You've got to be very very quick when you solder these or you will melt the pins out of the actual holder. Now no diodes are used at this end you'll be glad to hear. Now one thing to remember always always and that is always remember to put the plug cover on the end of the cable otherwise you'll have to unsolder everything to get it on now these pins you're actually looking at it upside down on YouTube but we've got pin one two three four Five, and the middle one six. At least that's the way I've numbered them so I won't get confused. Now pin one which is that one is not used. The theory is heat the pin, very quickly drop the wire in, take the iron away, let it cool and that should be it. Actually, I think I'll start with pin 6, because that one's in the middle. And we simply, I've got a bad angle here, because I've got to get the camera in and the soldering iron. Perch the wire on the end. Heat, let it drop, let go. That quick. And there it is, nice and snug. That's pin 6 done. Now I'm not going to be able to do this on camera and stay within time limit so I'm going to solder the rest of them in and I'll show you the completed soldered plug. There we go. I won't bend it too much because these wires are very delicate but there we have it. All the cables are now soldered on the Commodore end. Much quicker than doing the other end. Now we put this baby together and we'll test it. And there's your completed plug. And on this end, the completed, which is now an XE1541. Not an X1541. There we are. Now let's give her a test drive.